Hey everybody. What's up? We're going to do another unboxing today. <gasps> this one's uh, a service we haven't used before. This was recommended to us by Captain Algebra on our last unboxing video. So this is Video Games Monthly. So, uh, and just completely, completely sealed still in the, uh, packaging. Packaging so. from UPS or Priority Mail, yeah. Priority Mail, yeah. So we have no idea yeah. uh, what the actual box even looks like. So, it's like double Christmas. Yeah. There's another box. <laughs> A box in a box. All right. Oh. So, video games monthly. There we go. Yeah. Kind of like a Mega Man sprite. Yeah. On the front. BGM. It's pretty cool. Right. This one is not sealed. There so. is no seal. Okay. Okay. So, are we doing a blind, or are we just gonna open and kind of the common on the bottom? Uh, blind. Let's. Uh. All right. Open them up one at a time. I'm looking up. <laughs> Stop! Right, here's some uh, bubble wrap. All right, here's some cards. We'll get to those later. All right, first game I'm pulling out. NES. Hmm, interesting. What the hell is that? <laughs> uh, something I've never even heard of. Rad Gravity for Ooh. NES. Nice, nice. It's got a nice seal on it, so yeah. yeah. Uh, I've never heard of it. Activision. Yeah, we'll have to give it a try sometime. Maybe give it a good review <laughs> or bad. Heart looks super nice. Oh There's yeah, nothing wrong with it. Yeah, this was recommended by Captain Algebra. Like we said, uh, he said because of our issue with the corrosion, he's never had a problem with this. So yeah, so far so good. Oh boy, we're gonna right. go with number two. Number two. Yeah, that's the cards we're talking about. Yep, we'll get to those in a minute. This feels like another NES game. Micro Machines. Nice. It's a super weird cartridge. Yeah. Go ahead and show that to you guys. I think I might have it upside down now. Interesting. Yeah, no, I've never heard of. Cart looks pretty good. I know it's uh, racing. I've actually played Micro Machines before, but I've never seen that cart. Oh, uh, so it's just like one of those little RC cars, and you're kind of... Yeah, and you're like playing on pool tables, and yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, cartridge, again, looks pretty nice. Uh, it's one of those like gold cartridges, so the paint always chips off super easily. So, I mean, uh, it still looks really nice, even with that. Yeah. So... All right. All right. Not too bad. Next up, I think we had five total. I think that was the box I ordered. Okay. So, another one. This one feels like an N64 game. Oh, oh God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, we didn't get to choose genres. We just chose what uh, systems we wanted. So, unlike uh, the other one we unboxed, Retro Game Treasure, we didn't get to choose like what we wanted, like genres. So... We got a racer. I'm not a big racing fan, but uh, hey, Star, Star Wars, Wars Racer N64. But uh, yeah, looks good. A little bit of wear on the back there, but I mean, the otherwise... stickers are awful on 64 games. Yeah. They just don't have a protective layer of anything. Yeah. So yeah, don't use Windex or anything to clean the labels. Yep. You dry rub. <laughs> Alrighty, number four. Oh boy. Um, this one feels like an NES game. Some cards I chose and stuff. NES, SNES, and N64, so. Oh. Okay. I pulled out a ruler as well. <laughs> we'll get to it. Yeah. Kings of the Beach. It is a volleyball game on <laughs> NES. I see that all the time at Elf Stores. <laughs> <laughs> uh, fairly common game. Looks great though. There's nothing. Yeah. Like I mean, that's a reoccurring thing. Is the games look great? I don't yeah. see any, any issues. anything wrong with them. Um, right. and, well, this one's mostly just kind of to bulk up your collection, right? This yeah. isn't a lottery. Or oh anything. no, no. This is just uh, you got to choose what you wanted 
like system wise, and you can go and like list everything you already have so that you don't get doubles. Okay. But uh, yeah, they just they it's just uh, try out these games kind okay. of thing. And so, how much was this one? Uh, I believe it starts at thirty dollars for four games, and it goes up by five dollars up to seven, and I think you jump up to ten, which was like seventy or seventy five a month for yeah. ten games. Yeah. Okay. So we might be trying that one. I just want to give them a, a shot with the five games. So we may go to ten games depending on it because these are really looking good. Yeah, games look great. What's so, there should be one more. I'm pretty sure. Maybe not. I thought I chose five. Maybe I only chose four. Yeah. Okay, maybe I only chose four. I thought I did five. Okay, so video game monthly. We hope you enjoy your latest box. <laughs> Apparently, they don't auto-update your library. You have to update it yourself. Oh, okay. So, Retro Game Treasure automatically updates your uh, your library. Interesting. Got a sticker. Oh, okay. <laughs> Looks like a tattoo. Yeah. <laughs> Stick on tattoo, maybe? Yeah, it is a tattoo. Definitely a tattoo. And a cool ruler. Double-sided. <gasps> Double-sided. So... Yeah, yeah, not, not bad. bad back. I mean, nothing, no games that are really anything, no, but yeah. I mean, they look good, and I don't have any of these except for the Star Wars game, but... Yeah, I, mean, I didn't mark that one off since I didn't have it, Right, so, yeah. so I mean, yeah, pretty decent yeah. box. Decent box, uh, like I said, I thought I did five, I did guess I only did four, but uh, yeah, we, uh, very good, we'll, uh, we'll check them out, uh, think we'll go up to ten. Not right away. Not right away? <laughs> We're going to wait a little bit. <laughs> Maybe soon. Yes. All right. Uh, so we'll see you guys next month for Video Games Monthly, but we also have Retro Game Treasures yep, in the mail. Another one coming up in probably about two weeks. Yeah. So. All right. See you guys then. Thanks.